Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I am going to give you the solutions for week 1 assignment of software testing course. So let's see the first question. The purpose of error seeding technique is which of the following? So friends, these are my probable answers. Uh, I think option C, determine the number of latent books is the one of the answer and also I think option E also is the answer that is introduce known bugs into the course to determine whether testing is adequate or not because uh, error in error saving technique we actually introduce known bugs that means artificial bugs uh, to determine number of bugs remaining it means indirectly we also checking whether the testing till now that we have done is uh, adequate or we have to do further uh, testing to rem to determine the remaining bugs so option e could also be the possible answer so friends uh, it's up to you to decide whether both uh, c and d are answers or only c is the answer so i think c and e both are answers so let's continue second question The main purpose of integration testing is to find which of the following type of errors. So the answer for second question is module interfacing errors. That is option E. The third question. Usability issues are tested during which one of the following type of testing. So the answer for third question is option C, performance testing. That is option C. And fourth question, pick the correct answer, correct statement from the following. So the answer for fourth question, option C every failure is caused by a fault that is option c and fifth question which one of the following is false they are asking false not correct or true if they are asking false concerning uh, verification so there are three answers actually here there are option a option B and option C so mark A, B and C friends these are uh, fifth question is exactly correct there is no doubt at all and moving on to sixth question who among the following performs acceptance testing so friends actually many people gave the answer as or developers but actual answer is customer access testing is done by the customer or end user so sixth answer is option a and moving on to seventh question which one of the following testing techniques is effective for testing whether a developed software meets its non-functional requirements so for this the answer is option C performance testing but many pe people are giving answer as option D but the answer original answer for option option C is the original answer for 7th question that is option C and 8th question unit testing of a software module does not test which of the following options so the answer for eighth question could be option a and option d that means whether the module interfaces well with other modules and option d whether the module meets the non-functional requirements so mark a and d and ninth question which one of the following can be inferred from the pesticide paradox so the answer for ninth question could be option C after a testing methodology 
has been used on a program to detect bugs it will become ineffective to use the same methodology to detect remaining bugs so option c could be the correct answer for ninth question so many people are giving different type of options but i think option c is the correct one and moving on to the final question that is 10th one the v model of software development is not if, if you uh, observe here they give not not appropriate for development of which of the following applications actually v model generally used for small to medium projects but not large projects because uh, it is a type of sequential uh, process it means we cannot go back once uh, we have done the uh, testing and all so if you see here nuclear reactor control software it, it seems to be a very large project so uh, v model cannot be used here and if you see option b avionics software but it will not be the answer i think because it is it can be done by using v model and also automotive can also software can also be uh, built using uh, v model and management information system it may be the answer but i am not sure and graphical user interface can also be the answer I think the answers are option A, option D and option E. Friends, I am not sure uh, regarding 10th question and for remaining questions I have uh, small doubts uh, when, wherever I have mentioned in, the, in this video. So uh, please uh, support, support our channel and if you have any doubts please comment in the comment section. So if I change any answer later please uh, keep regularly checking this video comments so that I can uh, make any corrections in the answer whenever I know the uh, whenever I got the clarity regarding uh, the exact answer so please tune to our channel uh, like this video and share to your friends until then goodbye thank you